But it's not the kind of smoke you want to see in a smoke shop. Reporter Ayani Hughes has the latest on a fire that raged at a popular Midtown smoke shop. The fire may be out, but the investigation continues as crews are working to find out why this Midtown business went up in flames. This is cell phone video from a neighbor who first saw this fire. He told me it started around 430 Sunday morning after he heard a loud boom before the building went up in flames. It's likely that would be due to there was a electrical line that was attached to the building. It had burned off at the roof side and when it did, it was still currently live. When firefighters arrived, there was a plethora of flames and heavy smoke coming from the front of the village smoke shop on Juniper and Cortland streets in Midtown. Chief Bohatch says between the large amount of debris, the older style building and the heavy smoke from shop contents, attacking the blaze was more difficult than usual. We were unable to locate the source of the fire and if we're not able to actually go in and utilize suppression techniques to the uh, fire itself, then it's only going to get worse. Once the fire was located, crews were able to attack, suppress the flames and smoke and essentially save the products in the basement of the shop. Based on the knowledge and skill sets of Atlanta Fire, they're able to do an aggressive interior attack and really maintain the uh, condition of the building for its original format. The village smoke shop closed at midnight, so no one was inside or injured. The cause of the fire is still under investigation. In Midtown, Ayana Hughes, CBS 46 News. Well,